Um, you know, uh, I know he's got a good fastball. And I know he's going to try to challenge me with that, but I know he also, you know, uses a slider half the time. And, um, you know, I was trying not to get caught in between. And, you know, um, some of those pitches I probably missed, but, you know, some of his sliders were better than the other. And uh, you kind of just try to stay within yourself and kind of give it, you know, what you can do. And, you know, sometimes you just got to balance situations because you're not going to get anything to hit. And um, I didn't go, so I made the first, though. So. <laughs> I'm going to ask you the same question that it appeared Ron Gardenhier asked you. Did you swing? <laughs> uh, he said I didn't, so I didn't swing. <laughs> Were you surprised? And I know Gardenhier is an old school guy. After he got ejected, it did seem like he turned to you at first base and kind of winked and said, did you swing? Did you even respond? Yeah, I, was just, I just started laughing. He was just getting a kick out of it. Um, you know, he's old school. He's trying to have fun. And, uh, you know, he's trying to, you know, help his players and, you know, have his players back. So I get it. And, you know, he's trying to have fun with it, too. So. When you do hold up and two pitches later, you see what Glaber does. Do you, do you think back about how feisty and how important your at-bat has just become? Yeah, for sure, just because, you know, I warmed down and, you know, you know, I was probably like the fourth or fifth guy he faced that inning. So, I mean, I think he was probably, probably like 25, 30 pitches. And, um, you know, I warmed down and, and then they had to go change pitchers. And then, you know, luckily, uh, you know, he got something to hit. And, you know, the, you know, the stadium was going nuts, too. So, you know, that kind of helped us a lot, too. So. Stadium was also going nuts in the fifth inning when when Aaron Boone came out and expressed his displeasure with the strike zone. Do you think his rant energized you guys? Oh, for sure. And uh, even before the game, he talked to us, trying to pick us up. And you know, it just shows that he's got us, and he you know wants us to succeed just as much as he does. And you know, he'll do what it takes. And you know, I think that was the right situation for him to do that. And I think all of us respected that. And you know, it just shows um, you know what kind of guy he is. And you know, he wants to win, and, you know, we kind of were stuck in a rut, and, you know, we weren't getting, you know, the job done these last couple of games, and, you know, for him to do that, you know, that definitely pumped us up. What was his pregame message to you guys? You know, you, you know, we're, we're hurting, but, hey, a lot of guys have stepped in, done their jobs, and, um, you know, we, we need, you know, we need you guys to pick it up. You know, obviously, we got guys coming back here soon, but, you know, we're good, and, you know, we're going to, you know, beat everyone up, and, but just, you know, take it any by any, pitch by pitch kind of thing, and, you know, do the small things right, and you know the big things will you know take care of themselves. Duke, what does it say about the resilience of your team after, especially the way it fell apart last night? You're down multiple times in this game to come back multiple times and then eventually win. Uh, it's huge, and you know you just got to stick with us. We all know we can play. I mean, we got a bunch of studs in this team, and you know uh, a bunch of us stepped up tonight in those big situations, especially with all those home runs we hit in those innings, and then. You know, D-Rob came in and shut it down. You know, we trust Britain. Britain's been doing a great job. You know, it's baseball. I mean, stuff's going to happen. And, you know, you're going to give up weak hits, too. And it's all about, you know, sometimes it's all about, you know, luck. And, you know, it hasn't been going our ways, you know. And we've been hitting the ball hard, too, some side, you know, a couple of those losses. So, you know, it's just got to keep playing the game. You know, this game is going to bring you up and down as much as possible. And, um, you know, we just got to fight through it. And, you know, we're going to have, you know, Kutch tomorrow, which is going to help us a lot, too. And, you know, we got a couple of guys coming off the yield soon, too. So, you know, I mean, things are pointing up. This is a huge win for our morale, and, you know, I'm excited for what this team's about to do.